It might not seem unusual for Claire de Lune to be heard in a music building, even at a place like Stanford University's Center for Computer Research in Music and Acoustics. What is unusual is how Claude Debussy's classic is being played. Assistant professor and Princeton PhD Gu Wang is making music using the Ocarina app on his iPhone. Wang's first exposure to music came from his grandparents, who gave him an accordion when he was a boy. When his parents moved to the United States, Wang took up the guitar when they lived outside of Kansas City. But it was while studying computer science at Duke University that Gu Wang was exposed to computerized music. He later enrolled at Princeton and wrote the computer language that would lead to his app. Gu Wang says he wanted to bring the joy of music even to people with no musical training. The common thread through the apps is there's a well, there's a lot of fun to be had in making music. Um, and maybe that's the first thing we want to try to get across. Wang is the co-founder and driving force behind Smule, which makes Ocarina and nearly a dozen other musical apps. Log on to Smule's website and you find a variety of apps from Ocarina to Magic Piano to Sing, which allows singers to collaborate worldwide, to IMT Pain, which allows users to auto-tune as the rapper does to sing his songs. There's also Auto Rap, an application which uses input to make speech into rap using a variety of tunes, including one Wong called the Cornholio Test in a Smule video. Ocarina has proven to be one of Smule's most popular apps, with more than 8 million downloads since its release. Wang's innovative design got the attention of several publications, including Scientific American, PC Magazine, and the New York Times. Gu Wang wanted the apps to allow sharing in real time, so they include a feature that shows where other users are performing a piece. Others can give instant feedback on the performance using their own phones. Gu Wang says that social interaction is the whole idea. You know, we, we want to really bring the joy of music making to a lot of people, as many people as possible. Yet, at the same time, it'd be really nice if we can retain some of the, the very qualities of, of, of more traditional instruments, namely the ability, at least at the very least, to be expressive in some sense. Wang says that expression can take any form, from using ocarina to play Led Zeppelin's Stairway to Heaven, to using Magic Fiddle to play a Bach air, or perhaps for a more triumphant moment, using Magic Piano to play Chariots of Fire. Go Wang says one of his goals is to connect everyone through music, and he is on his way to doing it one phone at a time. In Palo Alto, California, I'm David Bird, VOA News.